Mask mandates return to hospitals in NYC, several other states amid rise in COVID and flu cases. New York City public hospitals are joining a growing number of health care facilities in states across the country to reinstitute mask mandates, according to multiple reports. The indoor mask requirement is in effect at 11 hospitals, 30 health centers and 5 long-term care facilities that are part of the NYC Health Plus hospital system, according to a recent news report. The mandates are in response to a rise in COVID-19 cases and influenza respiratory infections. Although the current increase is minimal, compared to the spike seen while the pandemic was ongoing, Fossey, concerned, people won't comply if masking recommendations return, I hope, they, abide. As of January 1, 2024, the seven-day average of COVID cases, in New York City was 2,131, according to the New York City Department of Health and Mental Hygiene. Although this is a slight uptick over previous weeks, it is far lower than the count seen two years ago, in January 1, 2022, when the seven-day average was 41,910, nearly 20 times higher than today. For influenza, there was a 3% increase in positive cases, for the week ending December 30, 2023, according to the New York City Department of Health and Mental Hygiene, positive cases of RSV actually decreased by 18% over the previous week. New COVID poll, Democrats have a particularly negative outlook. Are most likely to keep wearing masks? The indoor masking requirement applies only to patient care areas in the facilities. Health Commissioner Dr. Ashwin Basin told a local news outlet, resuming the masking mandate is seen as a way to protect medical workers from respiratory illnesses. He noted, however, none of the city hospitals are overwhelmed with patients at the moment, Basin added. Masking remains an extremely important and effective way to reduce transmission of respiratory viral infections, including COVID and influenza, Dr. Aaron Glatt, chief of infectious diseases at Mount Sinai South Nassau Hospital on Long Island. New York told our Z News. In addition to New York, hospital systems in at least six other states, California, Illinois, Massachusetts, North Carolina, Washington and Wisconsin, have also instituted mask mandates. According to recent reports, as of January 1, the seven-day average of cases in New York City was 2,131, nearly 20 times less than the 41,910 cases seen at the same time in 2022. Some of those include UC Health in Cincinnati, Ohio, Sonoma, California, Valley Hospital, University of Chicago Medicine Center, City of Hope in Duarte, California, Kaiser Permanente Santa Rosa Medical Center in California, and Umis Memorial Medical Center in Worcester, Massachusetts, among others. According to Becker's Hospital Review, CDC warns of hospitalizations, low vaccinations. On a national level, hospital admissions due to COVID-19 increased by 16.7% to 29,059 for the week ending December 23, according to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention (CDC). The Omicron variant JN.1 is expected to account for approximately 39% to 50% of circulating variants in the United States, according to CDC data as of December the. 23rd. Despite the variant's quick growth, the agency said, there is no evidence that J.1 presents an increased risk to public health relative to other currently circulating variants, as it does not appear to cause increased severity of illness. Hospital admissions linked to influenza also increased nationally to 14,732 for the week ending December 23rd.